my work, there's a lot around the female body, the, the, the beginning of life on Earth, uh, as much as a human, but also the octopus, the, uh, the, the, the liquidity of life and the liquidity of ways of touching each other through different meanings and tentacles, but also through emotions. From quite quickly on, we thought it should come from the idea of heels. I mean, it's quite an unusual demand to say, oh, will you create something for, for a night's sleep? And it sort of provoked me and the studio and the idea of a place where you, you hang around. And it's also now where you can really touch and smell and feel. The element came together from also the history of um, my practice, I guess, with glass, which is becoming quite um, a, a large part of my work in terms of I'm really interested in that liquidity that hardens. And so there's the, the, the nipples are, are made in, in a Murano glass, which uh, Berango has produced for us uh, in Venice. And then the earth, um, as you come in, you're, you're in a kind of a chapel and, and a cave. We dig in a way for, for a space to, to, to rest, rest and, uh, and, and reflect, I guess. It's uh, really a time to reflect on the future and the choice we make of how to live and how to explore and know our planets and, and, and respect it at the same time still inventive and playful and you know it and it's a very important moment we've lived and of course it's difficult but also a, a kind of slap in the face to wake up a bit maybe and try to um, be more conscious and I guess uh, Tiny Bees is, is, uh, is uh, posing a bit giving us a bit more of a pose uh, and making us um, have that time to to think and experience new things, of course, it's not about stopping experiences, but it's how, how we do that. Uh.